So in this video, we're going to tell you why we think Fort William is a great place uh, to base for your Scottish Highlands tour. Most people come to Fort William to climb Ben Nevis. It's an outdoor playground, lots of people there to experience and hike. But it also has a quaint small town. It's there on a lock. Uh, it has lots of cute places to eat and explore. Uh, we based out of Fort William for two reasons. First, as the Harry Potter train. This is actually the Jacobite train, which is based in Fort William. Uh, it starts here and goes up to a small town called Milan. So you can see this is us uh, coming onto the train. The train trip takes about four hours. So they do one in the morning and one in the afternoon. It's a steam train. Um, so they stop and get water uh, as needed. Uh, but you can see uh, the train itself, not quite Harry Potter, but super cute. Uh, you do go over the famous viaduct. Uh, we'll show you a picture of that later. And then, like I said, you end in this small town of Malag. You can choose to take it back as we did. But in Malag, which is a very small town in the Highlands, there are some nice little Harry Potter moments. Um, but it's just a great uh, town to explore. On your train back, uh, you'll see for uh, Dumbledore's final resting place. And then, of course, you'll go over the Glen Finnan uh, viaduct, which was made so famous in the movie. Uh, this is our experience of it. It was quite a rainy day, but it's as you can see, it's easy to get a video here. People camp out um, and hike to the viaduct to take pictures from below. So that's also an opportunity for you. The second reason why we wanted to base out of Fort William was to explore the Isle of Skye, which is spectacular. Our day started in Island Donan, the castle. Uh, as you can see here, the wind in the Scottish Islands can be uh, quite strong strong as it was for us but the castle itself is a great place to explore this isn't on the Isle of Skye itself this is before it um, but it's one of the most famous and most uh, commonly photographed castles Highlands was based there now we're on to the Isle of Skye you can see that it was as I said quite um, a we'll windy we'll day like on sky but that didn't let us uh didn't ruin our day it's spectacular uh on sky and i highly recommend we took a day tour uh things you can see are the kilt rocks uh which is gorgeous um you can hike the quarig uh which uh takes a couple of hours actually so we just kind of experienced a little of it went to see the fairy glen uh, which has these mysterious circular uh, stones. No one quite knows how they go, but as you can see, the roads are quite narrow and very busy. Uh, from here, we took the ferry back. Uh, it was a crazy day. They canceled all the ferries except for that one. Not sure we should have got on it and ended at Glenfinnan. So this is why we think Fort William is the perfect place to base, especially if you, like us, want to do the Harry Potter train and go experience the Isle of Skye. For more details on this trip and how to travel on a budget as a family using public transit, check us out at 3ticketsplease.com. And if this video was helpful, please like and subscribe for more.